are back at the Paula Casino Spa and Resort, a night of fights brought to you by TKO Boxing Promotions. Let's get to our next fight. Let's get to ring announcer Thomas Triber. Ladies and gentlemen, right now at this time, let's welcome to the ring, fighting out of the blue corner, Eddie Bossman Hunter. Each other. Yeah, Eddie Hunter, very, very, very pleasing young man, made his pro debut June 27th, a four-round decision over a Brett Harper in Tacoma, Washington. And tonight he has quite the daunting challenge, taking on Dmitry Chudinov, the power hitter out of Russia. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome to the ring, fighting tonight out of the red corner, Dmitry Chudinov. <laughs> And I guess the theme could also be, oh, brother, there's Fedor Chudinov, and now we see Dmitry Chudinov, 22 years old. He is 1-0, and zero, born out of Brask, Russia. Give me some of your thoughts. You were there ringside, Sergio, when he knocked out Otis Chenault in one round back in Reno, Nevada. Very strong, very impressive. Both these brothers fight similar, but they actually have a distinct way of punching in the body. Uh, Dmitry's actually a better body puncher than Fedor. Uh, this is going to be an excellent fight. Both these guys are undefeated, and I'm very excited about the outcome. Let's see what Chudinov has to say. Uh, I thought that uh, here my uh, longest dream came true, and I wanted to show the best of myself. So both fighters are in the ring. Let's get them introduced. Let's go up to Thomas Triber. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is being brought to you by Chet Kerner's TKO Boxing Promotions in association with PR Entertainment and the Paula Casino Spa Resort in Paula, California. It is scheduled for four rounds in the middleweight division, and when the bell rings, our referee in charge of the action will be Jose Cobian. Introducing to you first, fighting to my left tonight in the blue corner, he's wearing black trunks with white trim and weighed in at 161 pounds. Coming to us from Seattle, Washington, he has a professional record of one win and no losses. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Eddie Bossman Hunter. And his opponent across the ring tonight fighting out of the red corner. He's wearing black trunks with red and silver trim and weighed in at 162 pounds. Hailing from Serpuhov, Russia, his record consists of one win, no losses, and that one win coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Dmitry Trudinov. So we are ready for Chudinov and Hunter, four rounds in the middleweight division. And we begin round number one. See early on, Chudinov very, very aggressive. Looks like he wants to attack Hunter. Very aggressive. He's trying to land that left hook right off the back, just like his brother. There he goes to the body. Like I said, he's an excellent body puncher. Hunter wearing the black trunks, trying to work off the jab from the perimeter of the rim. And you can see Chudinov early on, sir, so he could just see this and feel the strength from ringside of his punches. Very, very strong young man. Hunter's in there to win, too, though. He's keeping him off with uh, his jab right now, and let's see how long he can last. Left hook to the body by Chudinov, and a winging right hand. Chudinov, certainly the aggressor here in round number one. Jose Cobion giving him the mandatory eight. It looked like a counter left hook, Serge. Yeah, and he's definitely dazed. His legs aren't under him. He got caught with a counter left hook, like you said. So early adversity for Dmitry Chudinov. Sergio, should he be clinching or should he be attacking the way he doesn't seem like he's really changed his tactic after that knockdown? Well, Hunter knows he's a powerful puncher. He still needs to be careful. He should jump on him. 
Oh, and Chudinov has a cut oh, on his right a eye. Bad cut over the right eye. You can see the blood streaming down the face of Dmitry Chudinov. So Chudinov early on in his professional career, some steep adversity as he keeps coming forward. Hunter up against the ropes. Hunter thus far, though, has handled the heat of Chudinov very, very well. Very patient. He's actually looking for the right openings. I like what he's doing here. He knocked him. He knocked him down. He didn't get too excited. He doesn't want to get caught with anything in himself. So I like what he's doing here. Hopefully he doesn't slip away from him. Couple of body shots by Chudinov. There seems to be some blood from the nose of Eddie Hunter. So both men are shedding blood early on here in this four-round middleweight battle. Jab up the middle from Hunter. Seems early on, sir, that the straighter punches of Hunter are beating Chudinov to the punch. And that's always the case in boxing. Nice right hand by Chudinov. Right hand over the top by Chudinov again, although Chudinov punches seem to be very wide with not much speed. You see Hunter coming right up the pipe once again with another right hand in the left hook. Hunter's just looking for the counter punches there. Chudinov is the aggressor. There he goes. See, he's just trying to check him with that hook. I, li I like what Hunter's doing here. Straight right hand. He has him hurt again. Right hand again. Another right hand. Both men letting the leather go here. It's been a back and forth round number one. Chudinov has already tasted the canvas. Missing that left hook there, but he's just trying to set him up for that counter left hook like he knocked him down with. Shooting up again. Good left hook to the body. Another left hook to the body. Right on the belt. It's been an eventful round number one. Right hand over the top by Chudinov. Trying to rally here in round number one after hitting the deck. Great round. Two strong punchers, two undefeated young men. Great first round of boxing. So there you have it. Round number one. We come back with more boxing action. the boss man here in round number one and certainly the four round fight he is in danger of losing this fight if he does not score something significant really quickly here you are exactly right he's two rounds he's two rounds behind and he knows that he's coming out aggressively and uh, looking to sting his his opponent and probably put him on the canvas shooting off just keeps coming forward he did not see round number two in his professional debut as he stopped otis chenault in two excuse me one round in nevada Good left hook to the body by Chudinov. Chudinov stalking again. Eddie Hunter boxing well from the outside. Hunter needs to continue doing what was successful in the first round. He needs to just be patient. Right now it looks like he's getting a little bit wild and a little bit a little bit desperate, it seems. Chudinov making an early, early investment, digging left hooks to the body. We'll see if that investment pays off. This again is only a four-round fight. Another left hook to the body again by Chudinov. Chudinov, Dimitri, he's a great counter, great counter puncher, but he's more of an excellent body shot. There it is, another left hook to the body. Does take the toll quick, and in a four-round fight, I could definitely see Hunter Wilton. There's another left hook and another left hook. Hunter again, staying stationary now in the neutral corner. What right hand does not land from shooting off. Hunter, though, showing some signs of wear and tear here in round number two. There's a winging right hand. Right hand over the top that misses. Hunter now, though, seems to be a little bit wary from the overall power shots of Chudinov, Serge. And there's a left hook over the top by Chudinov. And the body shots. you got to give a lot of credit to Chudinov. He tasted the canvas, was really hurt, and is coming back like if nothing happened, taking control of this round and control of his opponent. And there's a double left hook by Chudinov. Are the sales losing some of their win and steam for Eddie Hunter? Hit on a break. Referee Jose Cobion called for a break in the action. A two-punch combination landed by Chudinov as he touched glove. And Chudinov has a cut on his left eye now, so both eyes are cut on Chudinov's, on Chudinov's part now. What a physical fight this has been between Chudinov and Hunter. Four rounds in the middleweight division from the Paula Casino Spa and Resort in Paula, California. Left hook again from Chudinov. Left hook in return by Hunter. He's looking at Atlanta counter left hook all night. Hunter is. Right hand from Chudinov. And a double left hook downstairs by Chudinov. So the Russian is fighting back here after a very rough round number one. Hunter, though, digging in and fighting back and again lands his own left hook. It's funny, Steve. This looks like a video game. Chudinov cut on both eyes. Hunter looking for the counter body shots. And you can see some of the blinking of Chudinov. Obviously, the blood getting into the eye, affecting the vision of the young Russian. Chudinov trying to pour it on here. A strong bounce back round in round number two for Dmitry Chudinov. 
Solid round for shooting off. And when we come back, we should go to what should be a very interesting round number three. And there we look at the corner of Eddie Boss Man Hunter getting off his stool. He is certainly right in this fight, Sergio. He's getting up before his opponent, and he looks very comfortable and very confident. Hunter, Hunter now, though, seems to be a little bit wary from the overall power shots of Chudinov, Sergio. And there's a left hook over the top. Seen a spa and resort boxing brought to you by TKO Boxing Promotion. They get right back into it, Sergio. Heavy shots, very heavy, powerful shots on both, both men. Sergio, I get the sense that while Chudinov is the busier fighter with the punches, the punches of Hunter seem to have more effect on Chudinov than the other way around. You're exactly right, Steven. I'm interested in, in, in seeing how they're going to judge this. The, the judges are going to have a, a tough time here because, like you said, Hunter's landing the more uh, visible, effective shots, but uh, uh, Chudinov is actually being the, the aggressor. And you see him missing with the right hand, does Hunter. Left hook to the body by Chudinov. Hunter needs to keep doing what he was doing, and that's a straight the straight punches that were effective in the first and second round. He's just trying to land the big shots now. He's getting a little bit of wild. Hard clubbing shots by Chudinov. Goes downstairs once again. Right hand over the top. So Chudinov staying right on top of Hunter. Right hand to the body by Chudinov. Then an uppercut. So Chudinov here simply out hustling Eddie Hunter here in round number three. Yes, he is. Georgia, just read the body language. Hunter seems to be just a little bit fatigued, though, doesn't he? Yes, he does. But he's still looking for that counter left hook. So he's actually playing a little bit of possum here. Even though he is tired, he's actually playing possum and just looking for that counter left hook. There's a right hand to the body. Again, the hunter is now becoming the hunted here in round number three. A hard charge of Dmitry Chudinov. Chudinov again with a left hook to the body. Yeah, those, you can really start to see the wear and tear on Hunter. Those body shots are taking their toll. Like I said before, uh, the, before this fight, Dimitri is an excellent body puncher, and those shots have taken this toll in only three rounds. It's been a very entertaining fight here. We are going four rounds in the middleweight division. Dimitri Chudinov against Eddie Boss Man Hunter. Good body work. Four punch combination by Chudinov. Hunter trying to fight off the ropes does not seem to have the same type of snap or verb he did a round or two ago. No, he does not. His speed has uh, his speed faded away, and he looks like he's trying to trying to survive and just trying to land that counter shot, and uh, he's losing the round. By it. The blood that is coming out of both eyes from cuts of Chudinov has subsided here in round number three. Very good job done in the corner by their cut man. You see Chudinov again, left hook to the body, taking a shot up top, though. I think one thing they're going to have to work on, Sergio, win, lose, or draw in this fight, is really overall defense, it seems like, with Chudinov. Yeah, well, that comes with practice. That comes with, uh, with experience. Obviously, he takes it to the ground. He's not going to want to go down there again. So uh, he's a young fighter, and he's learning, but uh, he's definitely powerful and exciting to watch. Shooting off again, left hook to the body in the neutral corner, right hand over the top, lands right on the job. Hunter, Hunter's showing a very good set of whiskers. Right hand again, Hunter misses with the counter right hand. So Chudinov steadily putting the pressure on here in round number three, working his way back into the fight. And that's the end of round number three. When we come back, we go to the fourth and final round. Here we go, three minutes to go, and Sergio, I think the fight is in balance in these next 180 seconds. Yes, it is. Because of the, the knockdown, uh, this fight is a, a, a draw so far. It can, it, can, it can still end up in a draw, but right now, Hunter needs to do something really fast. Like you said, he's, he's actually being the hunted now. Shooting off, trying to dig to the body, something he has done consistently all night. Another right hand over the top, and once again, Hunter covers up. Shooting off, letting his hands go early on here in round number four. He's got some ground to make up after hitting the deck in round number one at the hands of Eddie Hunter. Hunter, though, seems like he's fading here, Serge. Well, with those body shots, I think uh, everyone will be fading. He, he's, he's taking some tremendous shots. His nose is bleeding. He's definitely debilitating, and uh, he's starting to hold a little bit now. Shooting off is just a, a beast in there. Very powerful and relentless. And there's a straight right hand followed by a left hook. Shooting off. Whacking boss man with a couple of good body shots. He's been this way for the last two and a half rounds after the first round where he saw the canvas due to a counter left hook. And there's another good left hook to the body. You see Hunter looking over at Jose Cobian, but those sh shots seem to be very legal, Serge. They're very legal, but they're definitely bothering him. And uh, he's trying to find some some way out to, to take those body shots away because they're definitely taking its toll. Now you see Hunter whacking away to the body. Does not hold off Chudinov. Now Chudinov with a big right hand to the body. 
There's a left hook for so the body shot, certainly taking their toll from Dmitry Chudinov. And they Great trade lesson. left hooks. Sir, this has certainly been an arduous test here for Dmitry Chudinov in his second pro body. I don't think they expected this type of test. No, they did not. But you know what? It's good for a young fighter to get tested like that, taste the ground, know what it's like to face adversity and get cut and go through all that. This is an excellent test, maybe a little harder than they expected, but it's all, it's really going to serve him well in his pro career. And you can just see the steam going out of the punches of Hunter, and right now it is all shooting off here in round number four, landing the hard, heavy shot. Here's a left hook on the inside, right hand over the top. Hunter backs up. Hunter, though, very, very game. Very game. you got to give both men a lot of credit, especially shooting off since he tasted the canvas really early. And you can really see the deep, heavy breath being taken by Eddie Hunter. Hunter. With a left hook that glances off the chin of Chudinov. Chudinov walks right through it. Now they're in the neutral corner. Chudinov letting his hands go. He needs to finish strong. Still a very, very tight fight. Remember, only going four rounds here. Chudinov and Hunter. Last 10 seconds. Let's see who pours it on. Has Dmitry Chudinov come back off the canvas to win his second professional fight against the very courageous Eddie Hunter. It's been certainly a good fight. And there you have it. Sergio, I think Chudinov may might have done enough to win this fight. Maybe, yes. He showed a lot of heart getting out of it, get, getting off the canvas, actually coming back and uh, doing what he needed to do, and that's put the pressure and, uh, and uh, take this fight. I think, he, I think he got it. Okay, so we'll see what the scorecards read. Remember, early on, it was a 10-8 round, you would figure, for Eddie the Boss Man Hunter, a counter left hand, who, which shooting off to the canvas. Well, we'll come back with the scorecards after this break. And we are back at the Palo Casino Spa and Resort where we saw quite a four-round battle between Dmitry Chudinov and Eddie Hunter. The scorecards have been tabulated. Let's go to the official result. Let's go up to ring announcer Thomas Triber. Ladies and gentlemen, after four rounds of boxing, we go to the judges' scorecards, and all three judges, Max DeLuca, Fritz Werner, and Alejandro Roshin, are in agreement scoring it exactly the same, 38 to 37, all to your winner by unanimous decision from Serpuhov, Russia, Dmitry Chudinov. Well, Chudinov goes to two and zero, Sergio, but it was certainly more difficult than expected. It's a good decision. He deserved the fight. He uh, he took the fight to Hunter. Even though he did get knocked down, he showed he showed a uh, tremendous resilience. He, he got back. He responded well, and he deserves the fight. Well, look, if you look at the scorecards, 38-37 all across the board, that basically means he was down 10-8, to and he did sweep rounds 2, 3, and 4 on all three scorecards to move to 2-0. and zero. Certainly a stern test for Chudinov and Eddie Hunter, and the action was back and forth throughout. And it, this is certainly going to be something that could serve Chudinov well into the future, Serge. Yeah, you know what? That was a great left hand right there. He was definitely hurt. He was shaky, but he got up, and he did what a true champion does, and that's uh, face adversity. And look at the body shot. Certainly a lot of invested downstairs by Chudinov. Definitely, and that, that between both brothers, he's a better body puncher. There you see it. Dmitry Chudinov got a sterner than expected test against Eddie Hunter. There you see it. Counter left hook, sending him to the canvas for the first time in his professional career, but he would rally. And you take a look at the disappointed Eddie Hunter who came out from Seattle, Washington, thinking he had done enough to win the fight. But we come back. We have more boxing from the Pala Casino Spawn Resort.